Good day everyone. My name is Mornay Ruckman and I'm super excited man to share my testimony with you guys today. So my journey in the Lord started about 14 to 15 years ago. I was fresh out of high school. I was still a young chap and uh, got baptized and I can still remember the excitement that I had in this newfound faith that I found in our Lord Jesus Christ. It was only in 2007 where everything turned for the worst. I met the wrong friends, got into the party habits, I got employed, received a quite decent salary and due to this it led me down a very dark road of a 12 year cocaine addiction and heavy drinking. So during this uh, 12 years of my cocaine addiction, it left me with extraordinary financial difficulties and the finances also contributed to constant disputes with my wife. I've got submitted to rehabs three times and God bless those people that work in those facilities. They do exceptional work. I received the best care, the best doctors, the best social workers, the best psychologists, but none of them could help me. None of them could set me free. On the 17th of February 2019, I had enough. I came home from work during the night shift and uh, while using drugs at work, I can still remember lying in bed sobbing, asking the Lord, why have you forsaken me, God? And I can still remember that still small voice inside of me that said, I will never forsake you, my son. And to prove it, I will set you free from your addiction today. On the 17th of June 2020, it will be 15 months since that date that I've been set free from a 12 year cocaine addiction in a split second. God released me from this incredible disease that I had. In November 2018, I had to apply for debt review because of my uh, addiction. Um, when I entered debt review, I had debt of over 200,000 Rand of simply loans to support my, my addiction. And it's been uh, just a year and a half now, and I've less than 70,000 Rand left to pay. Then I'm out of debt review. I do not know how I got this far, only God knows. I do not know how I was able to pay off this loan so quickly, only God knows. But that's, that's the God we serve. He is extremely, extremely generous God. And through all of this, the one scripture comes to mind is 1 Corinthians 10 verse 13. It says, God is faithful. And when you are tempted, you will find a way out. And that's what he has done for me. I was tempted all the time in my addiction. And at the end of the day, he freed me from this addiction in a split second. And due to this, me and my wife started going to church again, or she came with me to church. And um, on the 29th of February of May, yeah, 29th of May, 2019, we finished starting point together. And on the 30th of May, she gave her life to the Lord. And I also recommitted my life to the Lord. So God, through all of this, gave me new friends within the church family. He gave me new family within the community. And this is simply how good God is to each and every one of his children. I just want to encourage all of you out there with or without addictions, I want you to remember that if God can do this wonderful works in me, just imagine what he can do for you. And just to add, God also set me free from a 13 year smoking addiction. On the 7th of June 2020, I will be three months free from smoking. So the Lord didn't just stop with my addiction. <laughs> he continued to show his grace and his mercy by freeing me from a 13 year smoking addiction as well. So I hope and trust that this message will bring all of you encouragement and um, to know that the God we serve is faithful. And I want you to remember that with God, all things are possible. 
Thank you for listening, guys, and stay encouraged.